In the grandeur of the Sistine Chapel, a moment of divine intersection between earthly and heavenly realms is captured in Jean August Dominique Inga's masterpiece, Pope Pius VII in the Sistine Chapel, 1814. Amidst the towering walls adorned with iconic frescoes, Pope Pius VII, resplendent in his white and gold robe, is an epitome of spiritual authority. Seated or standing on a high throne enveloped by a scarlet red canopy adorned with golden bands and coats of arms, Pope Pius VII emanates an aura of divine grace. The white cloth embellished with golden floral designs cascades down from the canopy to the throne, a visual symphony that harmonizes authority with artistic elegance. The Pope's hands are clasped together below a jeweled brooch that secures his robe at his throat, a silent testament to piety amidst power. His low white cap over dark hair accentuates an image of humility amidst grandeur. Surrounding him are dozens of men, clerics in robes bearing witness to this celestial communion. Their eyes cast down upon holy scriptures, they stand as sentinels of faith amidst human artistry. Alongside them are laymen and at least one nun, their presence weaving threads of inclusivity into this tapestry of divinity and artistry. The walls echo stories untold, paintings within paintings create layers of narrative depth. On one side, landscapes unfold human journeys, on another wall nude figures float against azure skies, each stroke painting echoes of creation's grand narrative. Inga's signature in 1810 ROM anchors this artwork in time yet it transcends temporal confines. Every brushstroke is imbued with reverence for both spiritual authority and artistic ingenuity, crafting not just an artwork but an experience where viewers are not mere spectators but participants in this divine audience.